Happy Thursday, guys. Um, today's wad, we're gonna be doing kind of a cool down workout today, just cooling down the body, um, getting a little bit of recovery in. So uh, when you're approaching today's workout, go at a 60 to 70% intensity. You don't need to go full out. If today's your first day back, if you missed a couple workouts, feel free to kind of bump up that intensity. If this is your third or even second day, uh, sorry, your third or fourth day, I would say kind of take a little bit of a break, go a little slower. Um, if we think about just moving on that rest day or that active um, recovery day, we can start to promote recovery and feel better for the next days to come. So today's workout, we're rowing for 24 minutes, but every two minutes we're gonna be doing a movement, kind of like as a break and also with these movements, we're trying to add some more mobility and some more range of motion um, in our shoulders, lower body, and also adding a little bit of cardio mixed in there, some weightlifting at the end. So the first one is Turkish get up. So we're working on body positioning, our midline and our shoulder. So if you're looking to strengthen your shoulder or your wrist, Turkish get ups are a good one. Uh, cross body deadlifts, if you're looking to strengthen your lower body, um, strengthen your glutes. This one is gonna really target that glute when you guys are going across the body. And then the final movement on the third uh, interval, you're gonna be doing six and six single arm thrusters. So kind of using that overhead and the legs together to get that dumbbell overhead, so six per side. So then once you finish that third interval, you're gonna go back to, again, um, the one and one Turkish get-ups on the eighth minute and just re repeat for 24 minutes. So again, the goal is keep a consistent pace on the rower something like a 60 to 70 percent effort and then have enough to kind of recover and get into those movements at each uh, interval and each interval is happening at the two minute mark cool down um, we're gonna do some neck mobility so you're gonna check out that video from uh, z health um, if you work on a desk all day if you're kind of looking at a screen or in one position this could be a good way to kind of stretch out and add a little bit of mobility to your neck or maybe if you have a lot of strain in your traps um, this is another way that you may be able to open up those areas for yourself and maybe find a drill that works for you. So check out the video guys. It's a nice follow along may help you. Um, if you have any questions about it, ask our coaches. Hope you guys enjoyed today's workout. We'll see you tomorrow.